But it's spelled in the spelling. Oh man, on the ones and twos is DJ Hoot. Yeah, we're having his listening session today. And if you wish to be part of your listening sessions every Friday right here on XA, you can email us school XA at Cape Town TV or call us on 021-448-0448. Remember to follow us on Twitter, it's XA underscore live. On Facebook, it's XA on Cape Town TV. We're here till the hour of five, so make sure that you keep it locked because this is where it's most hip and happening. Remember, throughout the week, we're sending us to the exportation yeah, freelancers in the media industry and are brought in the experts because Longumdo Telikle Panel is a freelancer and they have a first hand experience of working as a freelancer. Whether they've been exploited or not, we're going to find out and what it means to be exploited. So, welcome to the show again, Snazo Tando and Zoe. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. Um, Umbuzo Kala, that I want to find out from you guys. What is the difference between a freelancer and an employee? Okay, so basic understanding your business. When you're talking about a freelance, we're talking about an independent contractor. So um those shayo, self-employed, in other words. And an employee is someone who has to follow the guidelines of having a boss and you get certain rules that you work nine to five and you're entitled to certain benefits yeah. as an employee in a company. Uh, whereas where you, when you are a freelancer, you create the times for yourself and you have to work and fight for your benefits yeah. a bit more than another. There's no illusion of security as a freelancer. Are you saying that you're, you're own, you are your own boss as a freelancer? Exactly, yeah. So how do you make money? Okay, so like a typical company that markets themselves, you market yourself. There are various different platforms for um, freelancers to put themselves out there or you can actually do it yourself by marketing yourself on the free social networks mm. like your Facebooks or your Instagrams depending on the page that you have and then you can boost your page to sell your services. But Tauti Umakrugonja Longe freelancer and employee because the employee Snazo is protected by let's say a government, CCMA mm. or whatever. How do you protect yourself as a freelancer? Against this is an exploitation, for instance. That's a great uh, question. I think it depends also individually as a freelancer, but how do you want to protect yourself? Mm. For example, I myself as a snazzle, I know when to say no. Mm. I know when I see that this one is not okay. Mm. I just tell you, I'm not going to pull up. You know, I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to do it because mm. this is how I feel. And also, like, how do you protect your work? People register their work so that you know that you've got your copyrights for your work, then if you take my co my content, then I know that now I can always go to court and say, no, but actually this is my work. Mm. That's right. so because yeah. as a freelancer, it's very important to protect your intellectual property. Um, what happens when you work for a company, it belongs to the company. Oh, yeah. Because when you sell your creativity in that sense, so you're not protected in that sense. But as a freelancer, it's up to you. It's up to you. Let's try for example. But Tondo, um, e companies as go within their rights to say Lendo Ian Zileo belongs to us because we create we create a for the company. Yeah, obviously, because you run a company, so it's company's rights to tell you what to do as an artist. But sometimes it depends if you are a self-employed artist, mm. then you fight for your own rights. But I believe that um, exploitation it's a stepping toe and at the same time it's a strength as a freelancer you know but then you can't let any company or anyone to take advantage of you you know yeah. contracts are very important when it comes to freelancing mm -hmm. uh, compared to employee every any type of business anyway so when you know bana okay na ux one when it comes to content the client mm -hmm. not your employer because you must remember, as a freelancer, you are not underneath somebody. You work alongside somebody. All right. All right. So, if, like Husnazo said, if the DI cleaner into as a freelancer, I'm entitled to say no. As compared to being an employee, you can't exactly say no to your boss uh -huh. because you're entitled mm. to give off those services because you've signed over that power to them to run yeah. your life, so to say. So, you as a freelancer, you've got the utmost power. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. That's the point of being self-employed. Wow, you guys. Yep. <laughs> I'm pulling myself to ask myself <laughs> right now because <laughs> tell you what, um, there's more to talk about, but I must see if you save you as Ingoma Ali, maybe we'll tell as number one. This one comes from Ro and it's titled What Mark D Girl No. Well, let's guess.
no more. This is what she's doing at number one. You girl know that was real music. You voted and we played it. So let it be R&B, let it be hip hop, let it be quiet or house music. If you like it, we'll play it for you as long as you vote for it. You can hop onto our social media platforms at Success on Cape Town TV. Call us on 021-448-0448. The hashtag to use today is hashtag TGIF because, ah, it's a Friday. Thank you, God. <laughs> Well, guys, now what I want to find out, um, if you just joined us, Mr. Today Exploitation, and we're still speaking of exploitation year freelancers. Mute when a contract is very important. Something that is signed. Verbal contract, does it work? No. <laughs> it's not advisable. As much as it's recognized under the eyes of the law, it's best advisable for you to put it on black and white. Because that way you have a, a, a soft copy that's either saved and a hard copy that you have to say, excuse me, Lama, as my client, I did specify in section, don't don't paragraph, what, what, by in the and so on. And so when you are going against our contract, so I'd like you and my lawyers to please either settle it or gang it. contract yet. as a freelancer? It becomes a problem. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I often see most freelancers putting you out on social media. Yeah, yeah, yeah they drag <laughs> they, you. You get dragged. They, they screenshot all your <laughs> on your communications and they put you out there. And you find that there are other people who are commenting on the post and they're like, "Hey, even myself, this person." Hey, hey. No. It's come out. Yeah. So it's always the case, but <laughs> I think it works <laughs> because they end up paying you because anyway they know that. They're not gonna get another client. Yeah. Mm. They're not gonna get another person to help them. You know? yeah. So yeah, I don't know if it's, uh, if it's the right thing, but it seems like it's working. Yeah, I should have blasted you, Obi Mavuso, because she made me MC her her gig. I should have used social media, but guess what? I'm doing national TV. <laughs> Girl, you owe me that money. You paid me a deposit. I'm still waiting for the half. <laughs> How can you tell that this is freelancing or this is exploitation? Um, how can you tell this is a freelancing or this is a exploitation? Uh, it's easy, two ways. Mm. Exploitation, obviously, sometimes you get booked, you understand? And then maybe law birds or pokers, they say that, okay, they're going to pay you a deposit before the performance. And then you end up not getting even a deposit. Mm. That's where it starts, mm. you understand? Because they're taking advantage of you, you know? And uh, freelancing depends, again, if you're working for a company or an agent or you're a self-employed artist. And then in that way, yeah, you're freelancing, actually. Yeah, that's what I can say. Another example that we can also add to the table to what Buddha just said is, um, for example, if you say, Manandi, I can work from home. And then now all of a Sunday, my client demands me to come into the office. Mm. Um, that's a, a form of exploitation because I'm not your employee. And my agreement as a freelancer is I either work from home or I work from a different sort of space, or I could be on site somewhere else but still yeah, attending yeah. to my commitments here. So those sorts of things, um, the, the, the times, they, they tell you, no, you must work 80 hours if you're going to be working. No, I'm not your employee. I will work according to my schedule mm. when I'm ready. I told you that my deadline is at the end of the month. There's no need for me to be working X amount of hours to appease you. Then, Snaza, how do you protect yourself um, from the exploitation as a freelancer? I, myself, as a Snazo, I make it clear, Namayo no is in capital letter. Mm -hmm. That's how I do it. If you don't communicate with me, if you invite me to your event and you expect me to come and speak as your motivational speaker or as your, uh, as your performer, and you do not communicate with me within like seven days, well, I have a right to take another gig. Mm. That's just me. And for me, I also like the paperwork, I like it. To say, okay, to you, I'm going to send you invoice, which I think we lack a lot as black artists mm. from townships to be specific, that we don't invoice, mm. which is invoice speaks for you. Mm -hmm. And we don't, we, 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 we don't, we are not brave to say this is how much mm -hmm. I charge. Asnam Kolo. Asnam Kolo, mm. yeah, that's the correct one. Yeah. Asnam Kolo. So I'm now, Usna, so I tell you, it's either we exchange, Talents, I do this for you, you do that for trade. me. Trade. Mm. We trade. It, otherwise, if it's not like that, you pay me. If you're not paying me, I I was doing that when I was still in high school. Because Bani Lendo, I, we are, but yeah, it's exposed. Exposure. Oh, exposure. Oh, yeah. exposure does not feed you. Mm -hmm. It does not pay the bills. Mm -hmm. So you can't be exposed for so long. No. 
or Uti for so long because Benzo mm. Musa, but then again, doesn't it work to your advantage to put yourself up to a out certain there? degree? Yeah, exactly. Like you said, when I was a teenager. When you were a teenager. Because mm. now it's my dialogue and we have bills and we need to be responsible citizens. And so exposure is not going to feed my child at home, it's not going to pay the lights and so on and so forth. And everybody knows this. And it's business at the end of the day, you can't get anything for my hand. What are the benefits of being a freelancer? Oh, being because freedom. Yes. Freedom. Yeah. Literally. That you can actually free? be free the whole day, sleep the whole day and you work at 12 p.m. Yeah. At 12 a.m. at, at night. Because exactly. you know that, okay, now. And you can have your glass of wine while you're working. Yes. <laughs> you're home. <laughs> yeah, yeah. so it's, it's uh, well, I think the most important thing is the freedom of time. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. Ooh. That's yeah, well, Leo uh, Indo, it's not nice. I know, but then I just said, Judge, we understand you, you're trying to make a living for yourself. Mm. However, call you freelancer, you don't have to report to anyone. Yeah. You are your own boss, like you said earlier on in the beginning of the segment. Mm -hmm. And also, the mo what's most important is that there's so much fulfillment and freedom of doing your own thing at your own time yeah. without anyone. This is what they want, this is what they expect. And you get to work as an equal and not as a subservient. Yeah. You get me? So, people who want to ask you more questions, um, that we did not get to. How do they find you on social media quickly? We've got 30 uh, seconds. Instagram and Tando Feni. I'm on social media as well as Facebook, Tando Feni. Yeah, yeah. So it's Sinazo underscore Um And it's Sinazo underscore Makiopo on Instagram. And then on Facebook, it's Makiopo Pinakazi. Yeah. So. And I'm Zoe um, on Zoe Charles on my Facebook and then on Instagram you can DM me at official underscore Zoe underscore Charles. Yeah, and I am Saint underscore Lama, but don't ask me those questions I don't have <laughs> answers to. Excel underscore Live is who we are on Twitter. We'll be right back. Papa, we accept.